I kind of want to... Oh, no. We got a healer. We got a healer. Oh, is he already gone? Damn. Okay. Oh, man. There's a, there's a package there now. I killed that way too close to a wall. Oh, no. What's going on, crew? Nobody here bringing you another Hollow Cure Save the Fans run. This time playing Minato Aqua and wishing her massive success in her future endeavors. Let's get started. Alright, let's see. No surprises here. I think we all know who I'm going to pick, you know. If the opening clip didn't spoil it at all, I think it was pretty damn obvious. Yeah, I heard the news. We're going to be talking about Aqua for a bit, huh? <laughs> okay, oh man, I got the, uh, the enemies kind of leveled up here, though. I wonder if I can survive in the Halloween castle. Let's give it a shot. I mean, I remember Aqua being... Pretty damn strong, actually, so... I think so. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. It came out of left field, didn't it? Aqua's graduating. I looked around uh, to, to get as much info as I could about, you know, the reasons why. And I'm sure everyone else did, too. Let's go with that. Uh, and it seems to be the the main reason is creative dif uh, creative differences. Let's level up the weapon here. <laughs> Should have taken the uh, Asakoko. but um, yeah, it makes sense. It actually kind of does. And I'm sure she's uh, she's not going to be the last that's going to leave because of this reason. Oh, that's actually going to be good. Yeah, let's let's take that. But, um, yeah, I don't want to sound too ominous here, but, uh, yeah, I've, I've seen some, some hints at some other potential graduates. <laughs> Man, that's, uh, that, that special doesn't seem to surprise me. <laughs> but, um... It's not necessarily a bad thing in this case. I don't think so. Especially looking at, at the, the reasons. It's just the, the way Hololive seems to have grown. You know, there was, in the beginning, there was a lot of stuff they could do. Let's level this up. Yeah, that's, that's good. See how much crits we're getting? It just carries through. That's going to work. I remember her being really strong, and yeah, <laughs> maybe these extra enemies aren't going to be a problem. But um, yeah, yeah, I, I've been looking into to a couple of things from uh, what they're saying, what what the other Hollow members were saying about the graduation. They're pretty torn about it too, but uh, it, it seems a lot of the important stuff, though. Um, the, the stuff you really want to know, I, I don't think you have to, to worry too much about Aqua. Because she does seem to have everyone in her personals, you know. <laughs> um, so she, she's still going to keep in contact with, with, her, with her buddies and all that. And that, I think, is, is the major thing that, uh, that you guys want to know, right? <laughs> is she going to be okay and all that? And she, she's going to do great. If the real reason was creative differences, um, the, the truth is she's not done entertaining people. She's just going to do it somewhere else. and she, she can be picked up by any agency if she wants to go that route. She's got one hell of a portfolio. portfolio. <laughs> yeah, I think this is actually going to be a good thing for her in the long run. And look, we're getting some lucky stuff here. Got to pick Aqua more often. Look at all this good stuff. Let's see. Let's, yeah, let's let's take all of that. Let's take all of that. See what I can get out of this. Look at that. Good stuff going on. I do want to get some food, though. <laughs> get an additional lots of cocoa. wonder what I should combine the uh, cutting board with. It was more than just the, the bounce ball, I believe. But, um, yeah, yeah, you see, I don't think she, she's the, the first Hollow member to leave because of this reason, and it does make sense. When you see how, 
how little it was when she joined versus what it is now. You know, back then you can do pretty much any personal project you wanted and now it's it's so corporate, you know, it's really hard to, to do that stuff, right? Oh, I hate those guys so much. I didn't even need to pop my special. But yeah, it, it seems like a lot of that stuff has kind of happened in reverse. Now it's it's really hard to, to get like the, the big time corporate stuff going. You know, like six years ago when she started, you wouldn't imagine something like an event at Dodger Stadium or something, right? Yeah, let's get that. I think if, if Sora really, really wants to, to hop on that stage at Yokohama Arena, it can be arranged quite quickly now. <laughs> so, yeah, but the, there's some stuff you can't do on more the the personal level anymore. I, I think Callie talked about it once, how, like, you can't use your own money to fund projects. That's one of those those corporate rules right there. Um, but there, there was a lot of changes that were happening in real time, too. I remember, um, was it a year back, there, there was, like, a... Uh, uh, like Kiara wanted to to paint her nails with with um, with the other Hollow members, right? And uh, literally the day after the stream, they got the update to their uh, contract that they're no longer allowed to do that. And I, I think that was a change that did happen right there in real time. And that's just an example of some of the the corporate stuff that's that's going on here. Um, maybe Aqua wanted to do stuff that was more on that level. Uh, but it's it's not the first time it's happened either, right? I mean, there was um, Hachima. That that's a really good example, I think. Um, give me a fan beat, no. Uh, Hachima, or back when she was Akai Hato. You remember that uh, that whole transformation deal? You know, she she actually um, brought her fans in on that project there, in a sense. Uh, with with a lot of fan theories and stuff that Akai Hato is going crazy or something. That's that's what was going on, right? And she she ended up liking those those fan theories, and she she actually breathed some life into it. It was one of those examples of something that that can only really happen in this this VTubing space, just that that level of entertainment. And uh, yeah, the, she transformed that character. That's. That's probably something you can't do in 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 their contract anymore. I mean, I, I think I remember seeing a clip of Kiara talking about some of the the fan art that that she got when she did her her armor costume. And um, she she saw one that had like silver hair with the, with the fan art and all that, and she she said it was really cool, but she can't actually match that because. She, she can probably change the blue highlights, but she can't change the uh, the core hair color, you know? And again, with the, the Hachima business, remember that, that entire stream of the transformation and all that? That's all been privated. So there is there is some limitations that they have, you know, creatively. And Aqua's pretty damn creative. It just tells me she she's not going anywhere when it comes to entertaining people. She's she's likely going to return to streaming. I don't know in the the VTuber space probably because that's that's where a lot of her fans grew from. But um, yeah, I, I think we we got a lot to be happy for Aqua here. Has the, the set, whatever she's doing, whatever she's going to do. Uh, it would not have been pop uh, possible if it wasn't for her portfolio, you know, her background at Hollow Live. This has done a lot for her. <laughs> yeah, so she she kind of made it. We're taking that. We'll take that too. Okay, but I want some foodstuffs. We'll see how that works out for me, for me, though. Okay. Oh, that's that's actually really good. It's good with the stuff we got. That's all leveled up. Get the fan beam. 
solo live. So if there's no targets within that that range, then then she's stronger, right? That's cool. Ooh, I kind of do want that, but uh... yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. We gotta keep her safe. That's kind of the the key for for Aqua. She's she's uh... yeah, she's definitely sweeping. <laughs> Yeah, I remember her being... She She is strong. There is no doubt about it. I don't think I, I've got anything to be afraid of with the Shubagellion. Alright. I think this will work out. Oh yeah, definitely collect that. Oh, I'm not afraid of anything that's coming my way here. Oh, that's so cool. That cat just goes in any direction you're pointing then, right? Oh, let's go. I got, uh... Yeah, what do you guys think? Though It is, it is kind of sad seeing a member go, though. So, you know... It does make me wonder about, you know, I, I know that they do keep in, ta in touch with uh, some graduated members. But what about, you know, future collabs? That's a thing I, uh, I'm i wondering about. But that that's probably more that corporate stuff, you know. It might be actually more lax right now than, than it will be in the future. So that's one thing that we can be sure of. Is, um... Yeah, I, I don't know. It's it's like um, I, I saw that that uh, collab with with Ina, Kali, and Henya, you know, from V Shoujo, right? Um, but would they be allowed to collab with Kason, for instance? I don't know. I mean, do you guys know? <laughs> Is, is that something set in stone? I'm, I'm sure that's a question someone's had. That has to have been. I mean, I'm, I'm not so much into the VTubing thing or how these talent agencies go about it, but I, I think it's a good question to have, right? And, you know, if, if she is indeed allowed to, um, you know, people would definitely want to see it. So that, that's kind of the general rule of thumb. I think if she, she was allowed to, it would have happened by now for sure, right? Especially if they, they collabed with uh, Henya. You know, at the, the same agency. You know, same agency uh, Kason's from. <laughs> A woman's an absolute queen, isn't she? <laughs> I remember seeing a uh, a clip of uh, Miko going up against a uh, a player in Soul Calibur who who used a uh, who used a a Kason, uh character, you know, the character creator in that game, and uh, they uh, yeah, and and Miko is saying she's always wanted to collab with Kason, so you know it's it's been talked about. <laughs> Oh man, this collab's so cool. <laughs> okay, what else are we getting here? I know this collab was something too. Just gotta remember what it was. Something that wasn't the... Uh... There we go. Oh, I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Yeah, see? Nothing to be afraid of here. I am taking a lot of damage, though. But man, this crit. There we go. That was quick. Not quick enough. But pretty quick. Another cutting board. What else do we want here? Oh, I kind of don't want an item here. Let's do a reroll. Level up to sake. That should work. 
She is a maid after all. She she can do this stuff, right? <laughs> Okay, what level? I'm only level 37. Oh, what popped? Something popped. I was getting a little overwhelmed by some enemies here, so... Don't want to take my eyes off that. All these ducks. Hmm. Do the idle song here, I guess. Oh, there it is. That's that's the sound I heard. Let's go with that. Got a pretty strong build here. Aqua's just uh, strong in general, as I said. She'll definitely be missed, though. Oh, now we get the, the greed stamp. Ten minutes in, is it too late to, to benefit off this? We'll get something. Hmm... Let's swap and strengthen. We'll get that. Deal as much damage as we can here. Okay, we're getting ready to level up, so... There we go. What do we want? Ooh, Hollow, do we dare? And let's not for now. I kind of know what I want, but it's not popping up. Hmm. I'm not going to trust another reroll. Not with that. I still got to get that one achievement, but uh, yeah, I was just, I'm trying to kind of hunt for that super collab too. One or the other at this point. I've only got two slots left for items. Oh man, that guy went down fast. Let's go. Oh, I can strengthen my greed stamp. Let's do that. Ooh, increase attacks. That actually does kind of work out for uh, Aqua. Still, money's more important right now. Oh, is this going to go down quick? You're going to drop an item. Yep, yep. Let's, let's get spider cooking. Ah, I don't want to have to take an item. One reroll. Eh. Fine. Let's see what we get. Okay, let's level all that stuff up. Let's see what we get. That was working out quite well, though. Gotta level up. We're getting there. I don't think I have anything that that collabs though. Oh, come on. Level up the potato. But hey, I should get some more items quicker. Yeah, we got plenty of time for it. I think I'm gonna undo the boss pretty quickly. Let's go. I should just pop that super whenever. I just like to save it for when I get overwhelmed, though. We're doing good, right? Oh, Pika Pika Man. I should have picked that up. That, that counts as food. We'll get that. We'll get that. Oh man, now I'm kind of regretting popping that special. We'll work it out though. Let's go. Let's see, I just want to collect all this experience here. The amount of damage you can dish out though. Oh, that's so good too though. Spider cooking. Let's do that. Let's do that. Oh no, projectiles. There we go. Look at all this experience. Let's go. Okay, now I'm not afraid of getting overwhelmed here. Mmm, credit card. Ah, it's so good. But we'll go with that. Oh, 
Oh, we'll make it through this. I'm pretty confident. I do have a Corone item, though. Gotta be careful where I, when I throw out the word confident. Let's go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Maybe I should have picked up the idol costume, but... I got my heart set on other things right now. Okay, what do we get? Ah, uh, stolen piggy bank. Why not, why not? Ah, uh, piggy man. There we go, that's the last food thing that I could I could get right now. <laughs> I right, should have got uber sheep. But we'll see. I don't know the correlation. If I got any uh, collabs here at all, or super collabs. Probably not, they are rare. So let's get other stuff. Yeah, maybe maybe Uber Sheep was what I needed to get. That or the, the full course meal, but that's that's a rare one. Okay, but our items are pretty much full here. That is such a cool collab though. This this could be one of my main ones here. Oh, Yago. I don't think so. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Let's go. Get all the cash here. Yeah, we're doing good on the cash, though. This is not going to be a failed run in the slightest. Let's focus on leveling up. Okay, now we got... Uh, these are Towas fans, right? Okay. That's maxed out. Definitely going to want to strengthen that. The items that we got. Oh, they're working out. There's the hammer. Alright. i got to watch it uh, growing under my, my experience. Is, is, that, is that what i got to keep an eye out for? Let's get that. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Max out the potato. There's gotta be something else we can do here. Getting a little risky, but we'll pull through. Always do. Well, not always. <laughs> Definitely not always. Usually when I get a little too confident, a little overconfident, that's when I bite it. That's what happened last time, I believe. Watch out for the projectiles. Oh. Oh. Damn. They're all over the place. Nothing I can't handle, at least for now. Got hollow coins here. Let's level that up, just because. Hmm. Level up everything we can. I probably should have done the the stolen piggy bank. Now that I think about it, I always get that that uh, remorse whenever I, I pick something. It's like, oh, maybe I should have got that other thing. Okay, four minutes until the boss, and I feel like I'm going to make short work of it, too. There's the uh, piggy bank. Because the items don't uh, cap out uh, as late as the weapons do. The weapons seem to cap out at seven. And items, they, they can be like one, three, five... We'll make this, though. The damage! Oh my gosh, that Yago went down. Ooh, that's actually really good. Let's swap. And yeah, strengthen. Let's get as much damage output as we can get. Oh man, I'm getting hurt. I'm getting hurt now. Now, now I'm now I'm getting worried. Now I'm getting worried. Getting a little overwhelmed. Pop that. Oh man. Oh, maybe I should take the hamburger, huh? 
Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Never thought I'd take that, but, uh... <laughs> uh... There we go. Alright, 56 here. It's safe to say I don't have anything that can super collab right yet. There we go. I think we can do... Stolen Piggy Bank for now. I kinda wanna... Oh no, we got a healer, we got a healer. Oh, is he already gone? Damn! Okay. Oh man, there's a, there's a package there now. I killed that way too close to a wall. Oh no! Okay, I got full meter though. There we go. I feel like if I take it, I'll die. Oh man. Yeah, I feel like I, I'll die if I take it. That, that. Oh my gosh, look at all this. This is just hell. This is hell. Okay. Those making the argument for the, um, for, for the, the genre to be called Bullet Heaven. I got one question. How? <laughs> How is this anyone's idea of heaven? Okay. Oh, that's... Yeah, I'm maxed out entirely. Might as well sell that. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna die. Nope. Nope. Not like this. There we go. We got... We got stuff. We're getting stuff. If I just keep dealing damage... Should be everything I need to do, right? Okay. What we got? There, we got something. Okay, I remember this one. Okay, what, what else should we get? Something that collabs with the... Uh, hmm. I don't know if anything here will, right? Let's see, what do we got? Okay, we got something. Got in the cutting board, let's do that. Okay. Pretty useful little thing to have there. Let's go. Okay, now the game's gonna try and kill me. Last minute, the 19 minute mark, that's where they try to kill you before the boss. I don't know how I usually pull through. I'll be honest with ya. I don't know how I usually pull through. Especially stupid decisions like that. There we go. I'm amazed I squeezed through that. <laughs> Aren't you? Come on. <laughs> That was an incredibly stupid thing that almost happened to me. Okay. Here comes the, the Hachima spider now. This one's gonna go down quick. Not quick enough, though. I gotta be careful of the uh, stunt, because... Yeah, that, that spider one-shots me from time to time. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Okay, I think I have an idea. There she is. That should be it, right? Right? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. We're good. We're good. There. Death. <laughs> Alright. We got a lot of cash off that one. So, yeah. Let's go to the shop. I think I'm strong enough. Okay, we're up at 36. Oh, that's the, the most expensive thing I can get right here. Speed's important too, so yeah. There we go. That's pretty much spent now. <laughs> okay. I mean, these are a thousand though, right? I mean, I can still go for some costumes. <laughs> but, 
yeah, I think I'll, I'll save that for another time. I think I'm happy with that play. Good games. See, I knew I'd pull through with Aqua. She's a very strong character in this game. But uh, yeah, back to the whole graduation thing. Uh, in no way do I want to downplay the impact this is going to have on Hololive or its livers moving forward. This is this is pretty big stuff, and they they they're still getting pretty choked up about it when they talk about it. So yeah, that's this is hard, but uh, we really should be happy for for Aqua because. This is a graduation uh, in, in a positive sense, you know. And up until this point, we've seen a lot of terminations and graduations due to health issues or even harassment. And uh, this, this graduation is on her terms. And if it really is due to creative differences, you know, uh, I don't think she's done entertaining then. She, she's gonna uh, move back to, to live streaming, I'm sure. Uh, but a graduation really is moving on to bigger and better things. And it's it's difficult to imagine something uh, that one can get into that's that's bigger than Hololive at this point. But uh, you know, especially because Hololive grown to where it is largely in part due to Aqua and others. But that just adds to to her portfolio and how impressive it is. She can get into something bigger. She can get into to movies or TV or something. She can get into this, uh, the entertainment industry. But I think. She's going to return to live streaming. I don't think she's done yet with that. Uh, and that that's why I think we should be uh, very supportive of Aqua and what she's doing in the future. Um, I, I don't think she's going to join an agency right off the bat, but I do think she's going to uh, do things solo, uh, which is really on brand for her. Uh, but she'll she'll get far because of her past, and I'm pretty sure that the Japanese uh, fans will definitely give us some hints on where she's going. She's she's likely gonna lay low for a few months because that's uh, that's just policy in Japan, you know. Once you're leaving a big company like that, uh, but when she she uh, returns to it, I'm sure it's gonna be big, and we'll all know it. So just just keep some eyes and ears open for it, and uh, I, I'm sure it's gonna be great. As for now, that'll be the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one.